Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so very much for clicking on this video. I really, really appreciate you stopping by and I really want to say thank you, thank you, thank you. And I do hope you stick around. And while you're doing that, please do not forget to like and subscribe. And also leave a comment because I love to post on Wednesdays. I mean, it's, you know, um, and sometimes I, I don't have the time so i do post on thursday too but mostly wednesday and then also sunday so i do mostly two videos um every week sometimes i just give a bonus to make it three but today i want to do one of the things i'm known for on this channel which is bag review i love 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 bag review especially i mean when they're very expensive I do all kind of love uh, bag review. I do high end, no brand names bags, all sort. You know, if, if you think I'm lying, go through my 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 videos and you see. So today's one is not an exception. Is this lovely salon bag and this dust bag? I just last year was a big year. Was it last year? Yeah, I think last year mostly. You know, I think 2001, uh, 21, sorry, also was a big year, but I think the ending for Saint Laurent, Saint Laurent, <laughs> YSL, because their bag became very popular. They came out with all these trendy pieces, you know, that was, you know, trending the same time other houses were trending. And all of a sudden, it just got into their heads. And they had a massive price increase. Not sure who advised them to do that. Now their bags is kind of unreachable, which is sad because I loved Saint Laurent. I have a couple of friends who love Saint Laurent. Unfortunately, not I guess anymore. But let's see what's in this bag and let's continue with the review. So the dust bag is, I think, double lined. Yeah wait it's very thick that's one thing i love about saint laurent my first saint laurent bag was my um my sunset that i got like i think in 2018 or about that and that bag like that bag is probably one of my oldest bags because i've sold every other bag that comes with <laughs> that comes around that comes with uh the timeline when i bought that bag i've sold everything so that bag i just cannot sell the quality of that bag is just up to now i haven't seen anywhere on tape but we're not going to talk about that and since then i have been drawn to saint Laurent as a as a brand house just for their bags and also i'm looking towards you know getting their um uh small leather goods because i mean but let's talk about this baby Okay, this is as I said, this is a very thick, thick, thick um, dust bag, and the quality is really nice. Okay, I love it. It's better than the Chanel bag, uh, dust bag. Trust me. So we're gonna talk about this. Um, why is it Lulu in medium, and in this with the black matted um, hardware? Um, I love, love this bag. I think they call it the why I say quote why quoted that's what they call this bag and this came out when um a lot of like the fluffy bags are raining what is that let's see I'm gonna clean that I don't know what that is but if you can see here there's a Y that goes down to the middle so I think that's why they call it the Y quoted bag so it comes with this snap closure magnetic one to it <laughs> with their uh magnetic closure is gonna magnet and it's gonna close and it's very you know hear that it's very tight strong magnetic closure i just love it scares me sometimes because i think when you do that because of how hard it is to like you open it that sometimes you might pull out this because this leather is so soft this is a lamb skin from what i heard but i love for some reason it feels even though it's lamb skin it still feels some sort of like thick you know like thick skin kind of and when you open it it's a single flap so this is a medium as i say so it's bigger than they have the tall lulu which is like a crossbody and then they have the lulu small which is 
you can also wear a uh, two chain on the shoulder or crossbody that it's i think the small lulu is more suitable for crossbody than the medium so it comes in these two compartment well two compartment and then there's a, a zipper compartment here where you could just put all of the things you know you you're trying to hide let's take that one <laughs> so um it comes with the seal or the packages and this still has a tag i wear the tag i just push it inside i know and let's take the when you look at the chain it's attached to these d rings on here no, I mean that is attached to the ladder. There's this pull right here, which is attached and then attached to the ladder. Let me see if you can see it. See? Okay. So it's not direct. I mean, it's still pulling on the ladder, but there's some sort of support before you get there. And it says the plastics are still on. The protective sticker is still on. It says Saint Laurent on the thing on the zipper and then when you take it out this is an exterior leather and interior is like a fabric clothing lining this is the thing i just left this stuff in there. and this is how it looks it's very very spacious very very spacious it has a zipper part part here also has uh like a pull like a leather pull so you pull it says Saint Laurent Saint Laurent Saint Laurent Saint Laurent Saint Laurent <laughs> um made made in Italy so the lining even though it's cloth lining it's still thick so that's how it looks it's so pretty stitching is nice I don't have any loose stitching it still has a sticker right here just couple I'm gonna have to clean this. I'm not sure what this is all about. It's a little bit of white stuff right here. I'm gonna have to clean it. Um, so this was got uh, bought from. I got it from my consignment store, but I think the original tag is from Nostrum, and they had that was when it was two thousand five hundred and ninety dollars, and then the the price increase came again for two thousand eight hundred and ninety dollars. And I don't know the person who bought it, the original person who bought it or owner, if they got it for this price or for that price. But I hope they got it for this cheaper price because that's their mistake. But let's see what fit in this. This doesn't have any feet. I wish it had, but it doesn't. So you got to be careful when you place where you place it because this is a lambskin, even though it feels kind of a little coated and top you still have to be very careful with it so right here has the chain on the handle and then this leather pull here it says Saint Laurent Paris so it helps when you wear it on your shoulder it doesn't like dig into your skin you know especially those like summer uh, winter uh, summer period when it is very hot and you don't want to put you know the chain is also hot you don't want to place it on your skin okay this is the sides, the sides are inside. So that's how it looks inside. Okay. Let's do what fit in here. Trying to see. On this thing here says Saint Laurent Paris. And that's the listen. Oh, and on the round thing here says Saint Laurent Paris, each of them on the fourth thing. Inside and out. It also says Saint Laurent on the outside. And then it obviously has this YSL logo. So the, for the ladder, it just has a on outside, not inside. Pretty, pretty, pretty. I don't see any, I don't know if they have like these little tags that normally stays like in the bag, inside the bags, but I don't see any. Anyways, let's see what fit in. I have one of my compact, big compartment, uh, compact, compartment, compact um, wallet from Michael Kors. I'm gonna use this because this is not an interior leather, it's just clothing lining. 
so because sometimes i'm scared of this if like if i have my the bags that have interior is leather i'm trying not to use because i don't want this to create some sort of like wear okay but this is not so i'm gonna use them have that in the first pocket and then my carry-on then i'll put it there i put that in the first because i want to reach reach it really easy um i have you can use this thicker one because it's thick enough it's big enough to carry it you know you can stand it up or you can lay it down it's massive it will carry everything that you need and more and that's what i like or if you just feel comfortable carrying like a flatter one is up to you when you want to carry and then because this is not a leather line i'm gonna just drop my key inside instead of like dropping it in something so that it doesn't like um uh create some wear and tear and then i'll go ahead and drop my phone because it doesn't have a back pocket here on the back so i cannot drop you know my phone so and that is that is literally what i carry and that is that bag and this bag let's see let's get this out it's just all you need to do is just place it there and then so i push it a little bit and then it finds its way to where it's supposed to be so this is my saint Lauren. It looks a little like massive, but it is not. I can't wear cross. I can wear crossbody, but it will it will be too big for crossbody. So I tend to wear it more like on the shoulder only. Um, I don't think you can wear this as a clutch. <laughs> it might be too massive. I mean, you can if you want to, but mm, that's not my style like that. That would be too much. So let me tell you the sizing of this bag so right now the price of this bag i got this for less than two thousand dollars from my consentment store i'm just gonna tell you the so i think the price of this for some reason this is more pricey like the black or black bag is more pricey pricier than like the gold or silver hardware i'm not sure why because this bag is going for thirty three hundred dollars on which side is number markers. Um then but the 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 ones with the gold and silver is going for like twenty two thirty two hundred. So I'm not sure why the you know the difference. So they say this is a detachable chain and leather shoulder strap. It is it's not detachable. I don't know what they mean by detachable because where where are they gonna detach it detach it from? You can't detach anything from anywhere. I don't know what they mean by that. But anyways, they say if you're carrying it as a a shoulder, it is nine it is ten inches. If you're carrying it as a crossbody, it is nineteen inches. Hopefully I will leave some more shots so you can see see how it fit. Um they say it has the snap closure exterior is has the YSL logo and then um i think it's a lambskin saint laurent lulu white coated over stitching lambskin shoulder shoulder bag exterior signature interlock ysl interior gross grain gross grain lining so and then it weighs about 0.9 pounds or 0 0.4 kg and the height they say approximately is 8.7 inches and then the length is 12 which is 12.6 inches and then the width is 4.7 so it's a bag made in italy so it it's a big bag okay if if you want to carry more stuff or you want to feel like a big lady <laughs> this is about to carry so I love 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 this bag um i need ysl to calm down someone who works there please or who can talk to people who put up these prices can you tell them to calm down because we i'm beginning to like get into ysl and now they're just pissing me off because 
when Shada was doing all this rubbish, a lot of people turned to YSL because they can get that feeling of like good quality leather with affordable, not affordable, like when I mean affordable, I mean like in um, luxury term, you know, affordable prices and people were rocking it now. People are just like, okay, what's going on? Why so? Because you're not doing it well. But anyways, that's my today. That's the review I have for today. Let me know if you still will buy this bag in 2023. I will still recommend it because it's such a gorgeous bag, especially now that Chanel have a price increase coming up. <laughs> that's, that's what I heard. So good luck with that. Um, I think they said the classic, the jumbo, which is like almost the same size as today's, is going, it's going to be over ten thousand dollars. Lord have mercy. I'm not even going to think about that. But, anyways, that is it. Let me know what you think about this. I will see you in my next video. Bye now.